four buckets of cement, two buckets, and a big pot of water. I think that's enough. Oh, I need something to scoop the water in a measured amount. Ooh, that's a lot of weight on the boat. Gotta accelerate nice and slow so I don't get that water sloshing around too much. I don't want it to pop the lids off and spill. Today I'm starting a water tank. Well, I guess I've already started it because I've dug out a little spot and got a bunch of the rocks over there. But today I actually start putting concrete in place. Oh, I can't believe this. It's starting to rain. Oh, I had clear skies in the weather forecast, which is always wrong. All right, I've got my cement stacked up under my little roof here. Ooh, well, if it gets a little bit wet, I guess I am using it within the next hour or so. Yeah, I guess that's fine. All right, proceed as usual. Just... Ah, seriously? Jeez, look at all the bright sky right there. Okay, I think this is going past. Oh, okay. Hopefully it's leaving soon. These are still dry so far. I'm building a water tank right here, about two meters across. I don't know how high it'll go. I just need to make the floor first. Now, I did make a concrete water tank before, and I wasn't sure if it was going to be watertight or needed some lining or something or whatever. But I just did straight concrete to test it out, and it works great, and it doesn't have any leaks or anything. So I'm doing that again. Just straight concrete will hold the water in, as long as I don't have any cracks or anything. I was going to put the water tank right here, which looked like just a flattish spot. But as soon as I stuck my shovel in, I realized, oh, this isn't a flat spot. This is actually a hole. And it's been filling with leaves and stuff and decomposing for years. So instead I turned this into like half a banana circle. So I took dirt from over here, lined it up here. And now I've got banana trees planted along here and hopefully their roots will suck up the uh, nutrients from the decomposing gobbledygook in there. Aha! Also, when I was digging over here, I found, I don't know if you can see it, but there's this big root right there. It's about the size of a softball, like, like a grapefruit. And I don't know what it is because I'd already cut the tops of everything off before I dug. So I don't know if it's edible or not. However, Whatever it is, I know that tubers will grow in this ground really well. So I need to plant some yucca and some yam pea, sweet potatoes and stuff, like in the side of this hill here. And hopefully they'll do as well as that thing down there. All right, back to my water tank. I believe I have enough rocks and sand here to do this. And then, looks like the rain is stopping. I should be able to go get my cement off the boat few minutes. All right, let's do it.
count the scoops on the first one so I know how much water to put in for the rest of the thing. With today's wetness level, two and two thirds peanut butter scoops of water. Okay, remember that. The uh, rain earlier, I'm sure, is saving me a bit of water now. Quit screwing with that, let's go. Fatality. Oh no, wait. No, mission accomplished. Haha. <laughs> Alright, let's clean up these buckets. Oh, I'm starving. I'm gonna have to go get some food. So that cement I was using today is left over from a while ago. I have not been able to buy cement in a couple months. I have a little bit left, but not that much.